One thing that I learned from Dave Ramsey is that the money we get in this life is not our money. It's God's money that we are called to manage. So if you got a mountain full of debt and there's a homeless person on the side of the street, you can tell there's a real, it's a real homeless person. It's not one of those people that's just trying to get something to drink. They're actually homeless. You're gonna drive right past them, pull into the McDonald's drive through the something you can't even afford, and you're gonna eat more than you even need to, to the point where you get to, you're gonna throw some of it out. I don't think we're managing that money correctly. I'm sorry, I just don't. Imagine if you cut out all your entertainment, right? I'm not talking about eat less, do less. I'm just saying do a cheaper version of it. Don't go out for pizza, make a pizza at home. Don't go out for drinks, have some drinks at home, right? Don't go see the movie in the theater, wait till it comes out, watch it at home. You'd be able to stack up like 10 G's in a year. Then you get 10 people to do that. It's a hundred thousand dollars. You know what you could do with a hundred thousand dollars in the Philippines? You know how much it takes for a family to, to get started with a house, a car, a business, this, that, and the other thing? About five grand, homie. Five grand. So you get ten people, nine people plus you, for one year, cut out all your extra expenses. I'm not saying you can't, you know, eat cookies and cake and ice cream. I'm just saying buy it from a discount grocery store, right? I'm not saying you can't watch the fights. I'm just saying don't pay for a $90 pay-per-view. Go to Buffalo Wild Wings, get a small order of wings, watch the main event and go home. You know what I mean? If you can walk to work without taking an Uber, don't take the Uber, right? So just save 10 grand for one year, 10, 10 people, 10 grand, one year. Five grand can change the life of a family in the Philippines. You can do that 20 times. In one year, you can change the life of 20 families, not 20 people, 20 families. And I'm sure the dollar stretch is very far in Nigeria and you know, like just a lot of other places, man. I'm not gonna pretend like I'm educated on everything, but I know something's not right when we got mountains full of debt, but we also got mountains full of food, right? How many credit cards you got in your wallet? How many cars you got in your driveway? I'm not saying don't live good. I'm saying don't try to live extravagant when other people don't have food and water. It's bananas. We're complaining about going to work. We're in an Uber. It's Friday, you get free coffee at Cumberland Farms, right? And then there's people that are so happy to have a job, but they don't have any shoes. It's kind of hard to get shoes to people, right? I think Jay-Z said after Hurricane Katrina, how hard is it to get some water and bring it to people that are thirsty? We gotta get it together here, man. Stay blessed up.